Hello there, I'm Lee Suss. Welcome back to Dead Island. It's the resort. Look, it's the, I haven't been here for ages. Isn't that nice? So, current quest is to go to... Um, I forget the shortcut button for the quests. Get to the hotel's roof to do with the transmitter. Um, I think we've just got to get to the hotel, but let's... Uh, Let's see, but first of all, a quick look in here with the merchant. I can't remember if merchants um, get upgraded as you get upgraded. So he's in the, the sort of initial, way into the initial area where we started the game. So does that mean that he will only have rubbish weapons or will he have good weapons? Let's, let's find out. I heard the scourge came from outer space. Sure, Wayne. Um, that's nothing special. I'm tempted to grab this just because <laughs> he probably had last time. I want to make a slicer. I want a slicer, and I will. Um, I'll. Uh, I'll need a normal baseball bat for that because my other baseball bats won't work. But I'm. I don't know. Is it really worth it? Let's see if we can find another base. If we don't find a decent baseball bat, Wayne, um, while we're out there, we'll come back and maybe buy yours. Enough. It's, it's just alien infection is what it is. <laughs> Came down on a nutter. Meteor. Let's go to the hotel. Now there's a lot nastier. Oh, hey, where, where's my, where's my armored car? I parked it here last time. Yeah, I think they 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 make the armored car go back to the, um, the point where you drive to the city. It's a spawn point. Jin's here though. Um. There's a lot of nastier stuff out there now. The the there's there's exploders and also don't think there's rams um, or anything like that. But I think we've got suicide out here now. So let's go. According to this, it is 178 meters, which is not too bad. Well, we could take a shortcut. Should we should we take the shortcut? It's this it's a nice day. Get me out of the car. How can I get out of the car? Hello? Can I can I get out of the car now? It's not letting me get out. What's wrong with you game? <laughs> Hold on a second. Sorry about that. I've no idea what was happening there. It would not let me out of the car. <laughs> I'm hammering air hammering the F key. Won't let me out. Okay. Um why don't we walk? I mean it's probably quicker and easier than a long run. That is, of course, a stupid suggestion. It is going to be disastrous uh, doing this, but let's let's try it anyway. I mean, for goodness sake, I've been walking around the damn city, surviving. Oh, look, my axe! What happened to my axe? Look, I've. That's really weird. This game is so buggy. Um. I have to check the end of the last episode. I did have a bit of trouble when I first came back to this area. I, where, where you where you drive through the tunnel from the city back to this area, you end up for some reason outside your armored car, stand there in the tunnel, the one with all the burning zombies running out of it. I don't know why they do that to you. It's uh, it's a horrible thing to do. And um, well, that was easy. I had a little bit of a panic and a bit of a struggle with some zombies. Maybe I managed to use up my axe at the time. It still knocks you down very effectively. I mean, what level were you? Well, I can't see now. Um, I mean, the zombies should level up with you. <laughs> level 25? No, it's still level 1. It's strange how I knocked you down so easily, but fine, I'm not going to complain. 120 metres, 90 metres. Is this quicker and easier? It is a bit quicker and easier, isn't it? I have to walk around the hotel, but it's easier than driving here. Oh, the narcissist is in the street. Off with your leg. Um, shouldn't be too bad around here. Uh, oh, you... Just to prove me wrong, some scumbag is hiding in a bush. 
throwing things at me. What was that you threw at me? No, you don't. Next time you want to sneak up on someone, do it without like any breathing. What did that scumbag throw at me? What's that? A knife? Like a kitchen knife. You, I can't even pick it up. Look. That's really horrible. Oh. Dirtbag. This is like this game. I'm sure it's more intelligent than they let's on. He did so. <laughs> Every time I say something, like, oh, we're doing all right. Um, doesn't seem that bad. The game then does something awful to me. It's not all dead already. Look, there we go. Um, let's go through here. They're all dead. And none of them are alive. Let's grab it anyway. Have a drinky. Uh, I think we should probably start collecting alcohol. What's this again. here? Because Molotovs are limited now. And I've got... Oh, hold on. Yeah, I saw that. It's equipped the alcohol for me. Thanks so much for doing that game. You're trying to trick me again. This game is it's in one of those moods again. Um, yeah, we need to start collecting alcohol. Because... I need to make more Molotovs. There must be some more around here. I suppose I've not got marks on the on the map showing me where the uh, the items are. It does seem strangely quiet around here. Don't you think that? I'd have thought more of these bodies would be alive. There's a live one down there, I think. They're all just dead, isn't it strange? Do the zombies burn out after a while? Is it like 28 days later? Well, I don't know which version of 28 days later you watched. But they were dead already. Oh, there's a live one. This is part of a quest that we never did. Or did we? I can't remember. I don't think we did. There's a, a thug down here normally, but there's also some loot. Usually as well. There's no one in here. Hello? Yeah, there's usually a, a big thug in here, and it's still fairly early in the game for you to meet a thug. It'd be quite nasty. What's in here? Anything? Tiring double blade. I can pick it up. I've got some space in my inventory. I definitely need some new weapons. Okay. Oh, we're almost here already. There's sometimes suicides <laughs> around the hotel, but there were also a few hidden chests I seem to remember as well. Oh, hello. <laughs> the others are getting up as well. Look. <laughs> I mean, I thought I could knock him down. No, I'm not doing so well, am I? I thought I could knock him down before I... stun him before they got to me. Even these guys are having a bit of trouble now, aren't I? Oh, there goes your head. Here's my other's machete down. No, I've still got a bit of power in it. Oh, I think there'll be some... I think there's some drinks over here. I'll, I'll hold off on... running back to get a drink. I can't hear a suicider. Oh! Come on in! What, what are you doing? If you're going to run at me... <laughs> you're only embarrassing yourself. <laughs> Really? You might hit me at the same time. I had the suicide, I'm okay. I knew I was one really somewhere. I definitely need a drink now. I'm sure there's some chests hidden around here. There he is. Oh, 
wide. For, just for a second though, I thought I was a bit too close. I don't know why. I clearly wasn't. Oh, a new machete. A dependable homemade machete. A flimsy. It's not that flimsy. It's making noises. There's someone nearby. Uh, what should we throw away? Let's drop that. Oh. Oh. That was a nasty shot. I know I could, I could hear him coming. I couldn't do anything about it. <laughs> and uh, I got the timing wrong. Oh well. I don't think you're about to die, Pony. You might do. I don't think so, though. If I die around here just from not healing myself, that's really stupid. Let's try not to do that. There should be drinks in here, I think. No? Maybe I need to pop back and get a drinky. I thought one of these... I thought one of these benches had like a drink on the end or something. No? Yeah, this is not so good. Let's um... Let's do a tactical retreat. Finish your quick before you get up. That went a lot smoother than I thought. I was expecting, rather. I'm sure there's something over here. I know there's one hidden chest. I'm not sure how good a level it is. There's one round here, but it's only a basic one. A flimsy scythe. I like scythes, but no. It's not that special. I'm just determined not to lose this axe. I want to repair my axe. Must be the final alternative axe. Come on. It's just so much damage, is the thing. <laughs> Where is he? And he there, by the way. 87 metres. There are quite a lot of people around by the hotel, from the hotel, I seem to remember. Oh, where's that? <gasps> what? Oh, you threw something at me. Okay, let's just not mess around, shall we? <sighs> We've got some heating kits. Where was that? What did you throw at me? Was that like some sort of little dirty little stick? No, you don't. I don't think so. <laughs> Stab on his head! Stab on his head! Oh my goodness, game. Where's that, where's that screamer? I'm a bit worried he's going to pop out. Ah, here he goes. <laughs> there you go. You got your little move, haven't you? Stop it with your stupid rush method. I hate that so much. Oh goodness. Yeah, not messing with you. No, I don't want to throw my hammer. I want to shoot him. Still not dead. Some people don't have to give up me. <sighs> yeah, I was going to say I was quite enjoying the fact that I haven't 
had problems with them sort of doing that stupid lunge thing before for a while. But clearly they're back into it again. Oh. Key to bungalow 14. Ah, oh, okay. Um, let's just have a quick look at this. I'm not going to do the quest, but you know. I must have missed this one before. Check Hotel Bungalow 15. Where's that on the map? Hmm. Why are there two markers? It's a bit weird. I could do it on the way back, maybe. I think we're here. It's ten after. Where the fuck is he? One on four point eight. Respond. This is the hotel. Maybe we should try again in an hour. An hour. One on four point eight. Are you there? Can you hear us? This is one on four point eight. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Well, hang tight. One on four point eight. Cause we're coming for you, buddy. That is, if the offer still stands. Of course. I'll call in a helicopter and we'll be evacuated to the nearest aircraft carrier. But first, you have to get here. We have wheels, we have gas, we'll get there. Wheels won't cut it. Well, why not? Where the hell are you? You see the ocean? That island on the horizon? If you had a high-powered telescope, you'd see me waving to you. That's where the prison is. Who the fuck are you? A convict? Speak! My name is Ryder White. I'm a colonel with the BIDF. Banoi Island Defence Force. I came to the prison to get my wife. A doctor, Emily White. Can we speak with her? What's that? Come again? We want to speak to her. I told you, she's badly hurt. Bitten by one of the infected. She was trying to help him. Heal him. I only know all this because of her. Listen. You try to soften us up by making us feel sorry for your wife and then promise us a way off this goddamn island, all from a fucking prison? Of course you're gonna be suspicious. How do you think I found you at the hotel? I'm a BDIF colonel, not some thug in a cell. So why don't you call your own people? Contact the fleet. Do you hear how bad the reception is? A bloody monsoon's coming. The fleet is 80 miles offshore in the middle of the storm. The satellite's down, we're- Cut off, any more questions? He's telling the truth. And how would you know? She's not just a hotel desk clerk, right? Time's running out. You coming or what? I guess we don't have a choice. But first we need to find a goddamn boat. There's no point. This is for nine. The prison is surrounded by a minefield. You have to find a guide through to the bunkers inland to Mengindi and find a smuggler called Moen. He knows the way. Bunkers? Japanese bunkers from the war. They're mostly destroyed, so you should have no problem entering. They will lead you inland. All right, White. We're taking you at your word. If this is some kind of con, I will personally take you off at the head. Trust me. It's us against them we'll and... be in touch. So there you go. Um, so, Mr. BIDF Colonel... Maybe there's something Ryder we can White use. ...is, uh... He's offering to get us off the island, but he's on the prison island. So we're able to somehow get there if we can uh, if we can get to his prison island, he will be able to rescue us and get us off the whole island uh, and safe from this zombie invasion. But he's um, oh, got a respawn, and he's on the island, so he's uh, getting his. His wife, who's a doctor. Oh, you took a few hits, didn't you? So we have to go and find the bunkers. So I've got look at the map. Now we've got a quiet point. Now that's the um, that's the the thing of me fourteen quest. Talk to Mike. Mike who? He's back at the, um, that's the, uh, lifeguard hut over here, isn't it, I think? 
we'll get back over there talk to him there and then we have to somehow get to these um, the, there were various, various bunkers on the coast actually you remember, you'll probably remember there's one of them there was one after we met that Russian chap we had to go into one of the bunkers where you can take tunnels so we can somehow go inland uh, from inland uh, in the jungle area we should be able to get a boat and the boat will take us to the prison island and um, hopefully to Colonel Ryder White